And while Portland may be referred to as Soccer City USA, the beautiful game also has a new semi-pro club north of the Columbia River. Fox 12's Nick Krepke checked in with the Vancouver Lightning in the inaugural season of the Western Indoor Soccer League. Left, right, left, right. Lightning strikes even when the practice clock winds late into the night. Past midnight, go to sleep for a few hours, wake up, go to work. Right, left. The Vancouver Lightning of the new semi-pro soccer club and the six-on-six -six gameplay is off the wall any time of day. Semi-pro is a bit heavy. Some of them are very nervous. Relaxed and knowing they are gifted turf time at the Clark County Indoor Sports Center. The Lightning storm in as the newest of nine clubs in the Western Indoor Soccer League, which is in its ninth year of operation. We're in here for the long run, you know. I think our goal is to uh, be able to establish a club that not only uh, gives back to the community, but you know, um, is able to uh, represent for the community. Captain Luis Santa Maria is a Hudson Bay High School alum who assisted in building the lightning vision. Commitment and mostly like just being disciplined and true to yourself, because if you really want to do something, you're going to make time. You know, there's not enough hours in the day to do everything you want to do, so you have to make the hours to do what you want to do. Keep your hands out, always. Lightning head coach, Abraham Salim played pro in Germany. They all come in, they give it 100% after, you know, a long day at work, and it's the love of the game. Gotta love it, like Longview's Omar Gomez, who arrives on the pitch from his gig at a construction site. Your IQ's gotta be a little bit higher, and you gotta think more ahead, so like three, four plays ahead, because it's so quick, and you get burned one time, you're outnumbered already. <laughs> While Omar punches the clock, Lightning teammate Matthew Alcarez Luna has class in session as a sophomore at Evergreen High School. I just go in blank minded, not, not gonna lie. Like, it's just, I just play my game, you know? It's like I try not to stay nervous, I just go out there and do what I can. From age 15 to 36, goalie David Rodriguez is living his best life. The San Diego transplant is rooted in joy for health as a personal trainer after losing 100 pounds to refuel his admiration for the beautiful game. For me personally, it is kind of continuing the path of the of the complete turnaround of the trajectory of my life and being as healthy and fit as I possibly can. While the wins will come, the victory for this passion project is furthering a journey in a sport and carving out potential pathways to the pros. What we're trying to give them is trying to strengthen this mentality strengthen their ability and give them that team atmosphere so they can operate together. But of course, that's an, a process that takes, I mean, you have to have, you know, patience. Yeah. Uh, in New York, I'm not that patient, but here <laughs> on the West Coast, yeah. I learn. We're a passive aggressive bunch. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. And it's, it's beautiful because it's something for the community. Well, if you want to catch lightning in a bottle, or at least here under one roof at Clark County Indoor Sports Center, it's community night on Saturday, one of the last three home games of this first season here, a 7.30 kickoff where kids 17 and younger, they wear their own club's kit, they get in free here. Doors open at 6.45. In Vancouver, Nick Krupke, Fox of Oregon. Wish uh, 